Hello everyone, my name is Daniel Spence and today on Team Strikes we're going to be talking about where to stand on the ice as a lines person. So, as a lines person, you want to be standing near the boards but far enough away that the puck can go behind you all along the boards and go down the ice for an icing. But, when the puck is traveling into the zone or outside of the zone, you also want to be in position so that you don't cause or prevent the puck from going in or out. An important thing to keep in mind is where the puck is traveling as you're going up and down the ice. Is it going into the defending zone or is it coming out and into the neutral zone? Depending on where the game is headed, you'll be wanting to stand either a foot inside the blue line or a foot outside the blue line. The fact of the matter is, if you're standing right on the line, the puck won't be able to come out of the zone or into the zone, and therefore you're putting yourself in the way of the play. That's why you want to be standing a bit off the boards, but also a bit off the line. And that's so that the puck coming out of the zone can completely come out, and also so that the puck can go completely into the zone before dropping by your feet should it hit you. Another important point is that you don't want to be straddling the blue line. You want to be completely over it either way, so that you're not in the way of the puck, and also, you'll get a better view when the puck is going in. Let's face it, as a referee, you want to make your presence known on the ice, but you don't want to be seen. One surefire way of getting seen is being in the way of the puck when it's going in or out of the zone. 